Welcome to the World Tarot. This is a series of Divine Masculine Diaries for the 9th of July 2022. Holy Spirit, show me the Divine Masculines who need to hear these messages today. Three of Cups, Six of Wands. Okay, somebody's gonna have a victory in reuniting with their Divine Feminine. Yeah, is that it? That's what we're getting? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Scorpio and Leo energy. Transformation and victory. Okay. Uh oh, 65 could be significant. Okay, so what's going on? There's some kind of conflict here. Somebody could be blocking. Okay, free of swords, heartbreak. There are people who are trying to uh, get in the middle here, who are trying to stop the union, blah, 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 no? Six of Cups, people from the past. There's somebody coming in from the past trying to stop um, a divine union for, from happening here. This could be a man, a past man going towards divine feminine at the same time as the divine masculine. Ten of Swords reversed, flipped over, which means the guy doesn't want something. Yeah, and he want, it's, it really wants to flip over, doesn't it? Ten of Swords reversed. The guy doesn't want uh, the cycle to end. This is a karmic from the past. Uh, could be a soulmate uh, who doesn't want the cycle to end with Divine Feminine. So Divine Masculine has some kind of competition here. What are we going to do with the competition? Is Divine Feminine going to accept this competition or what's going to happen here? Is Divine Feminine going to accept this guy from the past? Seven of Swords reversed. I think she knows about uh, what he's planning already with the Seven of Swords reversed. Eight of Cups. No, she's going to walk away from him. She already has clarity about who this person is and what their business is, that they're love bombing and all that stuff. They want to come into union just to cause conflict, you know, just to bully this person, to make this person feel unworthy. Yeah, okay, yeah. Rejection. Okay. Divine Feminine is going to reject this guy. Okay, how about Divine Masculine? What's going to happen between Divine Masculine and Divine Feminine? Nine of Wands reversed. They're going to get over some kind of trauma here. They're going to discuss some kind of past trauma. They're getting over it together or separately or whatever. I don't know. Or maybe they're separately uh, getting over this trauma so that they can come in and be together. Why do they keep coming in reverse? Eight of Wands reversed. 98 could be significant. There's no communication somebody could have healed when during no communication maybe both of them have healed during no communication they've healed some past issues yes they have knight of wands and the ace of swords these people could be very spiritual they could have had some um, what four of swords reversed yeah the separation is gonna end because both of these people have gone for some kind of spiritual awakening and some kind of healing ten of cups and now they can have the ten of cups there you go very quick everything is precipitating here <laughs> these readings went very quickly like the messages are coming uh, a bit too quickly i don't know but it's fine because i want clear messages something's manifesting something's coming together okay somebody's ships are coming in three of pentacles yeah and divine mask and divine feminine are going to be working together on something could be something spiritual Six of Pentacles, yeah. Uh, they're going to be helping people with something. They could come together to help other people with something. To heal certain things. What's going to happen? What kind of project is this? What are they going to be working? Eight of, yeah, they're definitely going to be working on something together. 65 and 68 and 98 could be significant numbers. Also 14. Five of Pentacles. Six, eight, five. That could be a part of a phone number or something or an address or something i don't know six eight five two two six eight five two could be an angel number i'm not gonna look for it now because i can't anyway um so people have guarded heart chakras people are in a victim mentality they might help people who have a guarded heart chakra and people who are in a victim mentality okay that's the people they're gonna help these people with emotional issues and spiritual issues knight of cups reversed yeah people who might have childhood issues they might help those kinds of people people who are trapped in the past 
people who are emotionally stunted, they're going to help people, okay? They're going to do some kind of humanitarian work together to help these people and stuff. People who have similar issues to them, right? But they got over those issues. Yeah, childhood issues. They're going to help people move into calmer waters to become independent, right? The king and queen of swords. Um, this divine feminine, divine masculine could be very intellectual, very intelligent, very good teachers. They could be teaching people something. They could be teaching and healing people. So there you go. That's the message I've got for divine masculine. I hope this helps. Take care.